So what was the most dangerous experience? Um, one time, me and my companion, we were tracting um, in this one part of one stairwell. And this old guy, he came up to us and he was like, don't come back here. Like, get out of here. I don't want to see you. And we're like, okay, sorry. And so we're just walking down the stairs and he yelled down the stairs like, you should be ashamed of yourselves. And we're like, okay, whatever. And so we go to the next apartment building. We start tracking there. And all of a sudden, this grandpa that was still, that was in that stairwell told us to leave. He comes out of nowhere. And he's like, I thought I told you guys to leave. And we're like, sorry. And then he's like, show me your documents right now. And because he wasn't a police officer, I asked him why. And then he grabs me and my companion and starts shaking us and is like, get him out and is yelling this and I'm like let me go and he kind of lost grip of my companion and he tried to grab him again but I kind of like pushed her out of the way and so he got me again and my companion starts running down the sidewalk and so it's me with this guy and then like luckily I was able to get out of his grip and then I just ran off but that was my scariest experience oh, that escalated quickly. yeah <laughs> Um, what would you say is the, this is kind of a hard one, but the most important lesson you learned from your mission? Um, the most important thing I learned was to be happy. Um, because, yeah, you have a choice to be happy. And, yeah, serving in Russia, you have to find ways to stay happy and stay sane. Because people will tell you, like, get out of here you're nothing, why are you here, They, you'll get rejected a lot. And then to add on top of that, it's freezing cold and you're wet and you miss home, but you still have to be outside. And so you're going to have to find ways to be happy. And so that's one thing I learned was to be optimistic and find the good in every situation. What, what was the craziest weather you experienced? Um... I think the craziest weather was when one night we were out on the street and it was in the middle of the winter and we stopped by this less actively and we were just there to say hi and so and there was 15 minutes left before nine so we had to get home and she was like girls you have to get home it is negative 11 outside negative 11 celsius and i was thinking oh okay that's probably just like 10 degrees it's not a big deal and so we're walking home and i'm just like i can't feel my face right now like i can't feel my hands what's up with this and so we get a phone and we convert it and it was like oh i can't really remember but it was like negative 20 something i think and so that was the craziest was walking home in negative 20 degrees fahrenheit what is the thing that you most admired about the Russian people? Um, just how willing they were to help people. Um, I just remember a lot of times if if in the subway there was like a, a grandma or an old lady that was carrying something up the stairs, there would be a guy there and say, no, let me help you. And so he would take it for her and carry it up the stairs for her. Or um, if somebody like slips on the ice outside then everybody comes around and picks that person up and says oh are you okay is everything okay um or if you need help with anything you can always like if you need help finding a street or a store or something you can go up to any random person and they will literally walk with you to that street and say okay is everything good are you good yes and then they would go um, so they're just very open to helping. Sometimes it was different because we would have a name tag on and they would say, oh, we don't want to help you. Um, but there, there's a lot of people that are willing to help.